Aha! These cards are the easily influenced cards. You'll see what I mean. So, I have found a group of very obedient cards that have cool abilities and they also follow my instructions to the T and I am going to be using these cards to baffle you guys in today's video so stay tuned. You use a regular old deck of cards, any pack will do. You start by shuffling it thoroughly like this. Now for this particular mystery, you need two cards. The two randomly selected cards in this case, we have a seven of clubs and a five of diamonds. So those are the cards we're going to use. Now these cards are inside the envelope. They have to be kept completely away from the pack. The reason for that is because these cards are easily influenced. Allow me to demonstrate. If I take the five of diamonds, which is a five, place it on the packet, give a little squeeze, all of the cards are fives. Now sometimes I do this, people think, well, they were always fives, but that's not the case. If I don't use the five, if I use the seven instead, give a little snap, all the cards become sevens. Now that's because... And that was a bit of Daryl's performance of the trick that I'll be showing you guys in today's awesome video. So I'll start this trick by giving the deck a quick shuffle, a cut, and another shuffle. Cause why not? And now for this trick I require two very special cards. And those two cards will be found by you, the spectator. But since you aren't here, I'll be doing the work for you. So as I'm dealing the cards, I would like you to call or stop wherever you'd like. Right there. So you could have said stop anywhere you'd like, but that's where you decided to say stop. And now I'll divide this pile into two equal halves. So then finally, we end up with two completely random cards on the top of each pile. For example, in this case, we've got the Five of Diamonds and the Seven of Clubs. So, if you might have noticed, I had an envelope kept aside since the starting of the trick containing three very special cards. These three cards are the easily influenced cards. So, you'll see what I mean. So for example, if the easily influenced cards touch the Five of Diamonds, all the cards become fives. Now you might think that the cards were fives all along. Well, that's not the case. So now, if so now if I take the cards and touch them on the seven of clubs, all the cards become sevens. Now that's pretty cool and deserves a like on this video. Now these cards also have another cool ability. If I take the card and rub it against both those cards, now the cards are influenced by the color. So if they touch the five of diamonds. Now they all are red. And if they touch the seven of clubs, you guessed it. Finally, they all become black. And now we don't require the rest of these cards for the remaining trick. So I'll set them aside in a corner. And now since these three cards aren't touching anything, they all look like that, that and that. Today's trick, in my opinion, is one of the most fooling tricks I've ever performed on my channel to date. This trick fooled me so hard when I first saw it. This trick was made by the one and only legend, the magician's magician, Daryl Easton. He sadly passed away not too long ago in February 2017 as he was preparing for his next act in the green room. Daryl has created some of the most fooling magic tricks and flourishes. One of those flourishes being the hot shot cut which took me almost one year to master. I have also made a video of the hotshot cut on my channel. I'll leave a link to it in the description below. So go check it out but after you finish watching this video. And if you haven't already, leave a like on this video and also comment down below 
how hard you think that Flourish is on a scale of 1 to 10. I'll also leave a link to Daryl's performance in the description below and also a link to where you guys can buy this trick. Unfortunately, that is the end of today's video. I hope you guys liked it and I hope this video made your day just a little bit better and I'll see you guys in the next video. Click on this next video to find out how the giveaway I launched on my Instagram went viral.